The new Ford Figo has been given a makeover with new headlamps, grill and bumper making it look more contemporary. It also gets fresh alloys and at the rear the design is quite familiar with only the tail lamps being redesigned. Overall the Figo looks more mature. The Maruti Swift on the other hand has a more sporty look with swept back headlamps, rising window line and curved rear end. However, the Swift is not as spacious as the Figo. The Figo offers much more boot space and legroom as well. If space is a key criteria, the Figo offers more. If you look at the features on offer, the Figo has a bit of an edge. For about 70,000 rupees lower than the price of the top end Swift diesel, the Figo offers features such as electric mirrors, two airbags, and a Bluetooth music system with steering audio controls. The only thing it lacks are rear power windows. The top end Swift offers the same level of features but no Bluetooth. When it comes to power specifications, the Maruti Swift beats the Figo. The Figo diesel has a 1.4 litre engine putting out 68 bhp of power and 160 Nm of torque compared to the 1.3 litre in the Swift putting out 74 bhp of power and 190 Nm of torque. The Swift is lighter than the Figo and is therefore a lot quicker in acceleration. To be fair to the Figo, it has lower turbo lag than the Swift and has equally good handling. When it comes to fuel efficiency too, the Swift diesel is better with a claimed 21 km per litre compared to 20 for the Figo. In real world conditions, the Swift gives about 18 km to the litre in city traffic while the Figo clocks about 16 km per litre. So can the new Figo challenge the Maruti Swift? Not really. The Figo may have been improved but it still isn't good enough for enthusiasts. The only area it can really take on the Swift in is on pricing and the space it offers. Big car space at small car money. Now that's something worth considering.